There's nothing like chilling with my girls Just me and my divas taking over the world What's up, what's up, Divas? It's your girl April from Many Faces of Beauty, and I'm back. I am back for the last wig video today. And the reason why it's the last one is because I am going to apply this one to my head with either some Ultra Hold or some Super Tape. So, for a while now, I have been getting a lot of requests and emails asking me have I ever tried a website called PinkLaceWigs.com. So, I told my Divas after Christmas is over, like around income tax season, I would purchase, you know, a wig from PinkLaceWigs.com. Because I was checking them out for like over a year now. And they got some really decent prices. The whole web setup is really, really cute. Divalicious out so I took and went and bought two not one but two wigs I bought a synthetic lace front and then I bought a human hair full lace so today I'm going to do the synthetic lace front which is called Lexus yes divas like the car Lexus and she is a yakky synthetic premium heat lace front she does have um uh, excuse me she has French lace in the front with some baby hairs and you know nice decent amount of lace as you can see and I got her in the color 4 slash 27 and she is beautiful 16 inches and she's not too thick like some of the synthetic lace fronts you find with the nice you know the nice um lace she's perfect I tried her on she lays perfect so I'm really excited about wearing this one so she is $84.99 very good and decent price she does have adjustable straps in the back if you want you can sew some wig clips around her or you can just put you know a couple bobby pins in the back and that's what I'm gonna do you know with my synthetic lace fronts I never put um I never sew wig clips I just put you know a couple bobby pins one here one here in the back and I'm good to go so this is Lexus and she's $84.99 so let me tell you this is that was my first purchase from pinklacewigs.com they come in this cute little bag right here diva out pink lace wigs premium quality lace wigs so let's begin the video for the Lexus the Lexus wig I'm going to put this in commentary style since I'm going to be applying her so let's do it all right diva so I'm just cleaning my forehead all the makeup and oils so I can get a good um, application I'm just using some 91% rubbing alcohol I'm going to let it dry for a few minutes and then I'm going to use my skin protector um, that I also use it gives a better hold when you're applying your glue adhesives or just your regular tape you you know, and it's a good uh, barrier between your skin and the actual adhesive. So I'll put that on and I'll, you know, let it dry for like two to three minutes. And then what I'll do next is what I'm going to do is I'm going to put my stocking cap on. I'm going to apply some Mastic P Spirit Gum over my stocking cap just so that way my stocking cap does not slip back. And this gives a really good hold. I had my, um, a full lace wig on for exactly two weeks until I decided to take it off with this method. You know, your wig cap does not slip back. You're not losing it. And it's just, you it protects the glue from getting on your hair in general and it also makes the full lace or the lace front come off a lot easier so you want to let that dry for like five minutes you can either blow dry it or you can let it air dry I let it air dry and then I just cut away the extra stocking cap just around the front perimeter of my hair and then I'll just tuck it behind my ear like so and just make sure you get all the strands and strings of the stocking cap like you see me doing here I'm just going to cut away and just you know best thing to use is a short scissor now what I'm going to use is my favorite ultra hold um, glue adhesive I will apply that to the front perimeter on the stocking cap as well as on the edges of my skin and I will let that dry for like four to six minutes just so it can get a good tacky feeling once letting that dry I will apply three strips of super tape two curved thin strips to the edges and one straight thin strip to the front of my hair just so you know better hold make sure you have some good tweezers because your fingers can get stuck to the tape pull your wig down very slowly and take your time I suggest using a good rat tail comb for um uh, for a, a, a lace wig application, be it short, be it um, a lace front, or be it a full lace. I feel like, you know, instead of using your fingers, use a good comb. A rat tail comb is always the best. And just smooth inside the, um, the, the wig cap, inside the wig, excuse me. Once doing that, you know, 
I will take a little bit of alcohol on a Q-tip and clean up the area like I'm doing. And that is from the skin protector uh, that you see. Sometimes the skin protector will make your skin look tight because it does get really, um, it just gets stretched strong hold. So you want to take a little bit of rubber alcohol on a Q-tip and just, you know, clean up the edges. Now what I'm going to do is just brush her and style her up Divas because I'm really feeling this one. She is super soft and a nice yakky synthetic lace front. I'm really really feeling this one. So let's see the end results and tell me what you think. Alright Divas so <clears throat> this is Lexus and she was really easy to put on. Check out the parting in her and she does have enough lace for the front. And you, like I said, you can um, put heat to her. However, I'm just going to rock her straight because it's much easier for me to rock her straight. You know, just pin her up at night and rock her straight. But I'm really, really feeling this, this one here. Let me see where my little hair clips are. But I feel like with this one, I can get my Beyonce straight look on. You know what I mean? Rock her. Rock her. She got the baby hairs. Very pretty synthetic yakky wig. Really, really like her. The hair is really soft. This is a really nice wig. And for $84.99, Divas, you cannot go wrong with this. So this is my new do for the week and this is the Lexus from PinkLaceWigs.com check her out 16 inches and she's not too long and she's not too short which makes it even better because she's not going to tangle so much and they have a lot of these on this site a lot of nice synthetic lace fronts the hairline is very very natural forgot to show you divas that check out the hairline very very natural hairline I'm really really feeling this one not all rounded, you know. Perfect natural looking hairline. Not too thick at the hairline. She's not too long. She's, I'm really feeling this one. So on that note, let me know what you think. Let me know what you think. This is a color number four slash 27, which I'm really feeling the lighter colors up here in the front. Because, you know, I've been doing it dark for a few weeks now. And I figured I'll go back. It's not too four color. You know, some of them are like an orangish color or light, just too light. This one is a perfect color. This one is a perfect color. I like the way they blended this color a whole lot. Like I said, the parting is really, really good on this one. And you get about three inches of lace on it. The baby hairs are not too much. So I'm really feeling those digging the baby hairs, digging the baby hairs. But I will style her up, you know, rock her. I probably even could rock her in like a, a, like a loose pony. You know what I'm saying? So let me know what you think of her. What you think? And I'll be back real soon. Stay diva and divalicious as always. Bye-bye.